We should trust artists because they have the ability to see what's truly going on in the world and be able to translate it into something that can be beautiful, it can be heartbreaking, it can be poignant, poetic, and really truthful. I think we should trust artists because we're more likely to tell you the truth, whether you want to hear it or not. We are telling what is going on at this particular time, which is very difficult, and I think we need that honesty a little bit more than ever. We should trust artists because artists are the ones that levy a sharp gaze on the times that we live in, um, that provide context for the way that we move through the world. I truly became an artist when I received the Artist Trust Grant and I was able to call my parents with the good news and share that I had finally gotten funding for my work. So when I got it, I cried like a baby on the phone and it's enormous, the support, because it's validating my voice as a woman, as a mother, and most importantly, as a minority artist during this current political climate. When I got that call, I was, I think, washing clothes, and I just sort of collapsed on the ground in disbelief. And I've used that money to live, and I think that's one of the beautiful things about unrestricted funding, is that artists need money and time to live and create, and that uh, money bought me a year in this city, a year working on my project, and I am extremely grateful for that. When you work for decades and you, you try to create good work and you try to be part of the community, it's nice to be recognized. And it, it's really hard to put a value on that. There's a lot of anti-intellectualism, anti-art sentiments. And this is why we need places like Artist Trust to become our safe place, to become the place that we feel camaraderie, where we feel like somebody's gonna be there that understands some of the things that we have to deal with. And to help us move forward and stay positive and stay creating work.